Hello, everybody. My name's Josh. Hi, that's me. <laughs> my name's Nathan. <laughs> and yeah, we're uh, representatives from your outreach committee at High School of UCLA. So um, a lot of you guys, especially maybe the visitors here from outside of UCLA, might be wondering, what's in it for us? Um, how can we get involved in the cool projects and events here at High School at UCLA? And so that's where outreach comes in. Here at IEEE at UCLA, our outreach committee's mission is to bring all the projects and events that we make available to our students and try to expand it to our greater community. Um, and so today we just wanted to show a few slides that showcase some of the things that we did in this past year and how we got involved uh, with the community around us. And so one of those things that we did is working with community colleges. So in collaboration with UCLA Sam Welly's Transfer Center, uh, we worked with Cerritos Community College to host a series of technical workshops um, that basically took the ops program material and condensed it into three weekend lectures plus project work sessions. Um, these workshops culminated in a semesterly iPod Mino competition, which you probably heard about earlier. And this was a good way to basically get those students to get practical experience early on before they move a university. Uh, this past spring semester, we were able to uh, oversee Cerritos Community College hosting their own workshop series with the same material, but basically taught by their own members who had completed it in the fall. And this allowed them to basically start propelling themselves toward a self-sustaining program. Uh, outside of Cerritos, we also worked with other community colleges, such as Santa Monica or East LA, in inviting them to Idea Hacks, which was our uh, very own hosted uh, hardware hackathon. And so we had quite a few participants there who also were able to further supplement their hardware. There we go. So next up in our outreach efforts, we have a really strong IEEE program here at UCLA. So we want to make sure that other four-year universities are also able to provide this program to other students. So that's where Ops 2.0 came in. So our Ops program has been happening for about the past 11 years now, ever since Leo started it. And we want to spread that mission and make sure that other students can still take advantage of these wonderful projects. So the Ops 2.0 program is basically taking all the projects we worked on in, in the Ops program, some of them that were mentioned earlier, and then basically packaging it and shipping it out to these other schools so that way they can learn it and then teach it to their students. So this year, we expanded our fully functioning universities to about six nationwide school, schools, uh, all the way from Chico State to University of Florida. And right now, we have about five programs in training, with many more to come in the near summer. So really, if you're really honestly, Ops 2.0 is just a great opportunity um, for other four-year universities to sort of pass along um, this knowledge. And it's one of our great outreach efforts here at UCLA. Next up, one of our new events, brought to you by Nathan. Right. Yeah, you may, may have seen me around before, especially if you're a high school student, because you would have seen me at Engineering Horizons. Um, just for a little more context, I was uh, the previous outreach coordinator, the one before these two guys. Um, my colleague Eli couldn't make it today, but I kind of want to talk a little bit about Engineering Horizons. And this was a high school outreach day that, a high school outreach day event that I created, um, and it was targeted towards uh, local K through 12 students from the local Los Angeles area, and the purpose of this event was mainly to try and give like the those students like a diverse taste of like what engineering looks like at universities because like a lot of some of the high schools that we've been in contact with were kind of talking about their struggles like kind of show their students what like is past high school because like personally when I was in high school I had no idea what I was going to be getting into um jumping into um, a four year university for engineering and even like if that was the right step for me. So the goal of this was to just like show them what that was all about and then we wanted to give them give them the full experience like seeing like oh what the campus is like, what uh, talking to with professors are like, um, knowing like a bunch of different student stories as well as knowing like what club spaces often look like within engineering at these universities. And some some highlights from the day that we had were uh, at the top right there we had so we had a professor panel so some of the professors, like two of them are actually here in this room today, but we had some of the professors um, to come and give a panel and like answer some questions from the students about like their experiences, their research, and just like their time at UCLA. 
And then we also had uh, five different engineering clubs working together with us. Um, and we held hands-on technical workshops to uh, try and give those students a diverse taste of like, what the actual like, engineering content looks like at universities as well. And this was the first year that we had this event and we're planning on hopefully running the event next year, both bigger and better. And that'll be these guys' jobs. But, but yeah, that's all I got. Um, so yeah, speaking about next year, uh, we're looking to basically bring outreach and expand it even more. So introducing a college workshop series at Pierce. So basically taking what we did at Cerritos this past year, and now we'd like to bring it to another community college, which is Pierce. Yeah, and then one of our other goals is to basically unite all the engineering organizations at UCLA and their outreach efforts and sort of get on the same page. So that way we may not be visiting the same area twice, or if there's an area that we're missing, we can cover that area as well. Basically just allowing um, all the students that are involved in all these amazing organizations to spread their message um, to more and more schools. Uh, high schoolers, stay tuned for Engineering Horizons 2.0. We're hoping to bring it back next year, make it even bigger, make it even better. Um, aside from that, also look forward to uh, some smaller events, some presentations or workshops here and there. Um, and then finally, we just wanted to build on the great efforts of past years. Our outreach program at UCLA um, has rapidly expanded over the past few years. We definitely want to keep up that expansion. Um, and just want to say a special thanks to Nathan and Eli for all that they've done. Uh, we'll take it from here, but don't worry. <laughs> Contact us at outreach at ieeebruins.com and we look forward to getting in touch.